Wisconsin's photo ID law remains a lightning rod for Democrats who watched the state go red in the 2016 presidential race for the first time in three decades. PolitiFact Wisconsin checks a claim on just how big of an impact it had on voter turnout. Allegations of voter suppression has been a big issue for Democrats. Senator Tammy Baldwin is blaming Wisconsin's voter ID law for a lower voter turnout in last year's presidential election. She said that because of Wisconsin's voter ID law, 200,000 fewer people came out to vote. 2016 was the first presidential contest the state's law was in place. Voters were required to show a photo ID to vote. More Wisconsin voters did turn out in 2012 when President Obama won. She was relying on a report produced by a group that's aligned with Democrats that said because of that law, uh, voter turnout in Wisconsin went down instead of up. PolitiFact Wisconsin talked with experts who questioned that report's methodology. Yes, there's consensus the ID law prevented some people from voting, but 200,000? There's no way to put a number on that, and certainly there's no evidence that the ID law itself stop 200,000 people from voting. PolitiFact Wisconsin rated Baldwin's claim mostly mm. false. And PolitiFact Wisconsin reports the Badger State is one of 34 states that require voters to show some form of ID at the polls.